God rescued me. Testify that I would have given up. And God said, no more. No more, no more, no more. Anybody have a no more testimony? Oh, you were doing all the wrong things. And God said, no more. Oh, praise God. You were doing all the wrong things. But God says, no more. Anybody in here have, 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 have that testimony? Oh, push up your hand and send me that. Amen, amen. Open up your mouth and let the devil know that, listen, I am delivered by the blood of Jesus Christ. Uh, hallelujah. We are in church today. We are in church today. So the Bible tells us that after the Lord Jesus would have had supper. Mm, glory to God. Please pray for me. In Jesus' name, amen. I, I, I can't find my glasses. Yes. After he would have had supper, he laid aside his garment. And he stooped and he washed his disciples' feet. Now, it was customary. It's a custom that in that part of the world, the washing of the feet were, 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 was, was a thing that is done showing hospitality. All right? So when you enter the people in place, because it was a desert place, right? Then, then, then wash your foot. Then you left one basin there. And you wash your foot and you come in. It was also significant to know that it was the, the subordinates who would have been washing the, the feet of the master. Many times I, I made this statement that this kingdom is an upside down kingdom. That means... If you're on top, you are on top to serve. All right? So Jesus demonstrated that. Jesus said, I'm going to come let me wash on the foot. Peter said, I just saw this thing up. You are the boss. Sit down. Let me wash your feet. Jesus said, listen to me, son. If I don't do that, You know, no part with me, you know. Peter said, No wash all in my feet. Beat me. Because he did not want to be separated from the Lord. So we just do this to show humility, oneness. We do it to show togetherness. We do it to tell Lafayette to come over this side. Over that side. We're together, but we're not together, so. <laughs> All right? And, and, and the gentleman, please come over this side. Come over here, so. Amen, church? So we do this in a very celebratory fashion. Amen? Amen. Are you hungry? Are you hungry? All right, okay, all right. So we're going to celebrate now. We're going to celebrate, all right? We're going to celebrate. Um, I'm going to go wash my foot.
Come on, praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Come on, clap your hands and praise God. Glory. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting. And his truth endureth all generation. We want to bless the Lord. We want to bless the Lord because he is good. There are, there are a couple of persons that I would love to make mention of right now. I would love to make mention of Sister Donna's son. Um, I think Ramon, Ramon, Ramon. Yeah, that's Ramon and Adrian and Adrian. <laughs> Okay, all right. We, we know Adrian, we know Adrian, but we, we hardly know Ramon. Um, Ramon, could you just stand for us, please? Turn around and let them see you. Yeah. And put your hands together for Sister Donna. Come on, Sister Donna, smile, man. Oh, yeah, go on, sir. Sure. That's Sister Donna's big son. All right, and he's visiting with us today, and we want to thank God. Amen. And right now, we, we have Sister Donna's three, three children in the house today. Wow, that is good. That is good. That is good. That is good. And we want to bless God. Adrian, long time we not see you. Happy to see you today. Amen. Amen. One of our own little brother. We used to kick ball on a pavilion. Let him call him again. Let him call you. Let him used to call you. What if I When we are playing ball out of pavilion, we used to call him one day. Soupy! <laughs> Yeah, Soupy. Yeah, Soupy. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah. We just want to thank God for you in the house. We also want to want to thank God for our sister Beverly, that is Sister Longmore's daughter. Stand up, let them see you again. Son, will you please stand for us, please? <laughs> <laughs> Turn around, that's Sister Longmore. And I bet you all, uh, the other person, could you just stand for us and turn around? Do you know, do you know this person? Turn around. Ah, yeah. oh boy. Oh, I'm so happy to see you, girl. It's, it's, a, it's been a pleasure. It's, it's, it is a pleasure to have you in the house. And we are, we are consistently praying for the family. We are praying for mommy and the family. You know. and we are trusting God that, you know, we will have strength. Amen. So we are praying that God will continue to bless and keep you and his mercies and his goodness will continue to follow you as you go through. Happy Easter to everybody. Y'all y'all not talking to me, right? Let me go again. Happy Easter, everybody. Happy Easter. Amen. Amen. And remember, Easter is not about the bun and cheese. But it's about the slain but risen Lord. Amen. That is what it's all about. He lives within our hearts. I want to welcome you all and I also want to welcome you back to church on Sunday morning. Yes, yes, come to church Sunday morning. We have a lovely time in the Lord planned for you. Please, early mean good. Early means good. All right, so don't be offended if you come and you're not, you come late. You will just miss out on what we had for you early. Amen. Amen. Um, we're going to be asking Brother Kevin to come forward. Brother Kevin to come forward at this time. Yes, Kevin. Yes, you know, pay attention. That's what I'm calling on you. Yes. I will get, we're going to be lifting the day's tithe and offering. If you have a tithe, nothing is wrong. We can give you a tithe today. Tithe and offering. Yes, praise God. Bible tells us that we must give and it will come back to you. Good we'll measure, press down, shaking together and running over. You are going to be praying, asking God blessing for the, for the givers today. In Jesus' name, amen. God and our Father. Lord, we give a thanks, we give a praise. Lord, we thank you for this day. Lord, as we are about to collect a portion of what you would have blessed us with. Lord, I pray that God, you will bless the giver. Lord, for those who do not have any to give, I pray that you will bless them.
one day their school will be open. As we are bold to collect this offering towards the building, Lord, we pray that God you will guide and protect us. In your precious holy name, Amen. 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 Praise God. So, saving grace of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the love of God the Father, the full fellowship of the Holy Spirit, the comfort, rest, remain, and abide with us all.
both now and forevermore. The church say, Amen. See you all soon.